The uh, Metaverse Prime fungicide has two components to it. One is the SDHI chemistry called adapidin, and the other one is called rhodioxinil. Both of them in combination have different targets. The mesophyll layer is the layer below the epidermis of the leaf. And when you apply Metaverse Prime fungicide, it penetrates the mesophyll and stays in the area where it's required. And when a pathogen like an early blight, alternary solani, tries to infect it, you have the fungicide protectant right on that surface. So this is a, a, a couple of plants of the untreated check, uh, and you can tell the infection is uh, moved in pretty heavily, and the foliage is almost dead. And this is the one that I pulled out of the Luna Tranquility treatment, and. Uh, the product uh, had uh, performed well in the early part of the season, but it didn't last long enough for, to give the protection it needs to the very end. This is a, a sample that we pulled out of the Miravis Prime fungicide program. Again, this was in a program through the season. So there is some infection that you can see, but overall there's been excellent protection right to the very end. And we expect that because of this protection, uh, potatoes uh, yield and quality need, would be better than the other two treatments in the program. We have done this trial for the last two years and now this will be the third year. We measure the efficacy not just on the control of the disease but on the impact on yield and quality. Consistently the Minervus Prime has outperformed Lunar Tranquility in this program. Yeah, judging from the research programs that we have done across the United States, starting from Washington, Idaho, uh, the Red River Valley, which is where we are today, Wisconsin, and even in Maine. Miravis Prime fungicide has performed very well across all these territories and all these geographies. This gives us the confidence that this product is, is, is going to be an excellent tool against early blight across the entire potato production region, where these pathogens are a problem.